<laughs> got a problem, got a need, is your mind in confusion? Got something to fix, looking for a solution. <laughs> Find what you need, gotta go investigate it, think it out, go design, get ready to create it. <laughs> check it in, check it over, try it out, go to test, if the problem is solved, this solution is best. <laughs> Now you hanging out with the techno busters. Now today I am joined by two of my friends, which just happens to be from Sinatema Primary and who started this whole thing. So give it up to Tabo Matabu. Guys, say what's up to the people. Hi, people. So how are you texters doing? I'm great. Mm -hmm. Well, it just happens to be that these two texters were busy telling me about the recent soccer tournament that the school just held. So guys, please tell the rest of the texters out that what you guys were saying. It was a lot of fun. Yes, and the September Stars won. Viva, Viva Stars! Viva Stars! <laughs> there were so many people and we all had a good time. You know what? I fully agree. Because it just happens to be that myself and the rest of the techno bosses were there. And believe me when I say the tournament was a great success. But now tell me, how do you guys think the team look. It was amazing. They look like a real team in their clothes. Mm. Even better than the ones on TV. Ah, whatever. You know, but you know what? And they did, guys. But, you know, I'm sure you guys at home didn't think that they'd be able to put together a soccer kit, as well as putting together such a successful tournament because they didn't have money. But nothing is too much for the techno busters. And you know what? All we did was follow the steps in the technological process. And by using processing, we were able to turn raw material into a final product. And obviously the result was a great day of soccer. Processing. Processing. When you take a raw material and you change it to make a new product that has more value. So now the world at our lips for the past few weeks has been processing. Now do you guys at home remember what processing means? Mm -hmm. <laughs> ways that we process these materials with combination and preservation and um um what's the other one again construction hey you know sometimes i think i should just give my title over to you guys <laughs> <laughs> you can't quit a lot of people still need your help okay tom if you insist <laughs> okay let's recap combination is adding things together to make something new. Didn't we combine a whole lot of stuff to make lemonade the other day? You can also combine boiling water and tea bags to get an infusion of tea, which is another way of combining. Then we combine that with juice to get iced tea. You surely know your stuff. But now here's the big question. Can you give me an example of combining something that isn't food? Uh, if you mix color with cloth, is that combination? Yes, it is. So you can see you guys are really thinking. Now, if you dip cloth into dye, that is combining color and cloth, guys. Now, that is the process of combination. Now, all processing involves three steps. That is input, process, and output. Input, 
process output. Right, and on to our next method of processing. Preserving. Preserving is to make it last longer. Preserving! Now that was a whole lot of fun. But now do you guys remember what we made that involved preserving? Chutney! Well, to make our chutney, we combined various food ingredients with spices. We cooked it and bottled it. Now heat, sugar and vinegar are used to preserve food and make it last longer. Preserve. Preserve. To make something last longer. Food that is preserved can be stored for many months. So this is a question to get you guys thinking at home. Now, what can we put on wood so that it is preserved from the harsh rays of the sun? Paint and varnish. That is absolutely correct. Well, we need to protect and preserve our wood by varnish or painting it. You will find in some burglar bars at home that some of these are galvanized. This is the same as painting or varnishing them to protect them from rusting. Wow. And our last word is construction. Construction is fitting together or building to make a new product. Okay, so we've gone through preserving and combining. But what about construction? Do you guys remember what we made by constructing something? The Cinetimber Stars made bags. That was a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. Now the construction method we used was weaving. But what else did we construct? I'll give you guys a clue. We molded something into shape. We made our trophy from coils of clay. Yes, we put one coil on top of another until we had a cup. Now that's the order of the day, guys. Another mission is solved. Now the kids from Sinatemba Primary came to us with a need, and that need was to get a soccer kit for the tournament. Now through processing, we were able to design a solution for the problem. And the solution is getting them to use raw materials that were available to make what they needed for the soccer tournament. And the result? A great day of soccer and drinking lots of lemonade, guys. And you heard all about it only on Technobusters. Now that's the way of the technological process and that's the way the processing game goes. Until next time. Guys, I need to get this. Technobuster Workshop. I just received word of more problems, a letter, a cry for help, a plea for action. Hmm? Well, it seems like the work just never stops yet at the workshop. But anyway, that's why we need you guys to help us out. So make sure you're with us next time when we use technology to solve yet another problem. Until next time, for myself, the workshop, and the rest of the Technobusters, goodbye! Bye.